<laughs> hey y'all. Hey family, happy Saturday. How y'all doing? Uh hey I got a I got a question for you. I I I need I need I need some help. I got a question for you. Neil from Australia. Hey brother. Cousin April's on there. Hey y'all. I had a question, serious question. Man, it's hot in the mug. I'm gonna go swimming in a minute. I'm gonna fix that. But um, hey, South Africa in the house. I love me some South Africa. Blessings. Texas is in the house. Um, hey y'all. I got a serious question. I shape. Serious question. So, you know, the world is is opening back up. Uh, a couple things, real quick. You gotta hear tomorrow's word. Um, I'm giving the other two levels of spiritual warfare. It's gonna bless your life. Uh, another thing is, I had, I was blessed to go and speak for a phenomenal church, uh, Way World Outreach, uh, Pastor Marco and uh, Lisa Garcia uh, in San Bernardino. Phenomenal church, and the Lord gave me a strong word uh, that you can actually find on YouTube if you look for. Um, way world outreach on youtube you'll find it uh and it's up there and it's a blessing um somebody asked where my beautiful bride is uh she has a saying about drinking water <laughs> i'm kidding uh she'll be here in a minute she'll be here in a minute um so that thing uh really really uh it was a word that just really it was out of body. God just, he did a thing. So go watch it. But I got a serious question. Ontario. Pastor Ontario. <laughs> hey, Portia. Hey, family. Um, I think that's Portia. Uh, brew. Brew. <laughs> um, soon. Soon. About one. Uh, we're, I mean, we never close, but I understand what you mean. The full-on in-person experience. We're going to open it ASAP. Um, but a serious question. Very serious question. So things are opening back up. Like like the world is opening back up. And, you know, I'm in Cali. And and uh, I'm in Los Angeles in particular. And, and uh, I forgot how serious a traffic issue we have in L.A. Like, whoo. Like, I forgot all about it because... For the past 15, 16 months, you can just get in your car and go anywhere. It's all good, right? <laughs> Somebody's funny. I'm drinking my water. Mind my business. Uh, bless you. Bless you. Um, anyway, so now, man, people are out and it's taken just a great amount of time to go short distances. And I forgot about that. I forgot about that. And so it's starting to get to me and then you know in california i think in most states they have this 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 carpool lane and so here's my question here's my question justin bless you here's my question they have a carpool lane and the rule in the carpool lane is that you can ride in it if you are on a motorcycle so when i'm on my motorcycles i, I, I ride the carpool lane and or if somebody is with you, if you're not alone. Now, my Bible tells me that I'm never alone. <laughs> the word of God says he will never leave me nor forsake me. <laughs> uh, so my question is, when the Lord says, uh, I am with you always, even to the end of the age, I'm with you, I'm with you, fear not. All these passages of scriptures that say that God, God says, okay, God, he's above the law. God says, I'm with you, okay? I will never leave you or forsake, you're not alone. To me, my interpretation of that is that even when I'm driving in my car in traffic, the Lord is with me. And if the Lord is with me, I am therefore not alone. And if I am not alone, that I have access. Come on, Ralabotasha. I have access. <laughs> come on, to, to, to the lane that God has prepared. 
So I'm wondering, I, you know, in the multitude of counselors, there is safety. Yila Bosha. Whoa, glory, glory, glory. And I am wondering if, if God is with you. Come on, in the Trinity, let's go Trinity. Father, Son, Spirit, right? Jesus was the Word made flesh, right? He became human for us, okay? Jesus is the one that says, I'm with you. I'm just wondering if somebody says, I'm reaching. <laughs> I'm just wondering, I'm just, no, I mean, that's got to be, that's got to be a, a defendable argument. It, it, it's got, can I, if I get a ticket, I'm telling you, I, I'm going to try. I'm going to let you know, I'm going to try because I'm the type of guy, sometimes I have to try stuff. I'm going to try it. And if he pulls me over, can't you see it? He's going to pull me over because he see me in the car. And he, Howard Patrol is going to walk up to the car and I'm going to just start speaking in tongues. <laughs> He gonna walk up to the car. How you doing, officer? And that might get me out of it right there. They're like, this, this brother crazy. Let me let him go. But no, he's gonna walk up to the car, and uh, he's gonna say, "How you doing, sir?" And I'm gonna say, "Blessed and highly favored." <laughs> Somebody said, "Jehovah," Je I love that. Je H O V uh, Lane. I love that. I'm serious. Like I'm. A, he gonna pull up. You know, he's going to pull me over and I'm going to say, he's going to say, how you doing? I'm going to say, blessed and highly favored. And he's going to say, do you know that you were in the HOV lane, the carpool lane? And I'm going to say, yeah. Well, you're not supposed to be in the carpool. I'm going to say, why not? And he's going to say, because you can't do it. You're alone. I'm going to say, never. <laughs> I am never alone. You might be alone, but let me tell you something. You don't have to be. Just lift your hands right now, officer. Lift your hand. Lift your hands right now. You don't ever have to be alone again. And I'm gonna get the police saved. See, this is an evangelistic mission. There it is. There it is. This is kingdom. This is kingdom. Hallelujah. God says I'll make a way out of no way. Look, he just did it. And so, I don't know, family. <laughs> what y'all think? <laughs> y'all think it'll work? Y'all going to bail me out? <laughs> They're going to put me on a 5150 hold. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Shelby's like, sounds like an opportunity. Yes, it's an opportunity to evangelize. See, this not even about, it's not even about me. See, this is selfless. This is selfless. This is totally selfless. <laughs> I love you. Um, I hope you guys are having a, a great day. You got to laugh, man. You got to laugh. You have to laugh. I saw something on the shade room today that tickled me and uh, somebody posted, like, be, be honest, like if 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 they let R. Kelly out and he had a concert, would you go? And the comments were hilarious. <laughs> uh, but seriously, you got to laugh sometimes, man. It's uh, trust me, they're going to be days where you have to cry. They're going to be days where you have to to endure stuff and not feel great. Any moment that you get to, to laugh. Uh, to have a good time, to not take yourself so seriously uh, is, is a worthwhile moment. I love you. God bless you. Let's check in tomorrow. Church is going to be fire. Uh, invite people. Invite your friends. I'm dealing with spiritual warfare. We talked last week. If you missed the one from last week, you got to get that. Uh, tomorrow, I'm continuing. I'm, finish, I'm closing out that series, uh, and I'm getting into some of the deeper things as it relates to spiritual warfare, and you will leave tomorrow's meetings 7 a.m 9 a.m 11 a.m 1 p.m 6 p.m this is all pacific standard times you're gonna leave those services freer lighter enlightened empowered uh and walking in an authority that uh i think will be next level for you so i love you uh i'm about to go and get up in that carpool lane go save some souls go save some police officers souls pray for me and uh i'll see you all in a minute love you blessings